Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Biochemistry Concepts. This video is about denaturation of proteins. It includes what is the meaning of denaturation, agents causing denaturation, alterations after denaturation and types of denaturations. Coming to meaning of denaturation, it is the disruption or disorganization of the secondary, tertiary and quaternary structures of a protein molecule. So in this picture you can see, so there is a native protein. After denaturation, it loses its structure. The structure is unfolded after denaturation. During denaturation, the primary structure of a protein is not affected, but the remaining structures like quaternary, tertiary and secondary are affected. Coming to the agents which are responsible for denaturation, it includes physical agents like heat, UV light, ultrasound, high pressure and violent shaking. Coming to chemical agents that are responsible for denaturation, it includes organic solvents like ether, alcohol, acids, alkalis, urea and various detergents for example sodium dodecyl sulfate coming to what happens to proteins after denaturation that means what are the modifications or alterations that takes place in a protein molecule when it is subjected to denaturation denaturation leads to chemical physical and biological changes in a protein molecule coming to chemical changes after denaturation the proteins show decreased solubility and they show maximum precipitation and many chemical groups they become inactive for example the sulfhydryl groups physical changes after denaturation the viscosity of protein solution increases and the rate of diffusion of protein molecules decreases coming to biological changes the proteins they become biologically inactive so denaturation destroys enzymal and hormonal activity so denatured proteins are easily digested and after denaturation proteins cannot be crystallized coming to types of denaturation there are two types irreversible and reversible irreversible is usually seen in case of proteins for example when you boil a raw egg it leads to irreversible denaturation Another example is, omelette can be prepared from egg, but the reversal is not possible. Coming to second type, reversible denaturation. Sometimes a denaturation is reversible when a denaturating agent is removed. For example, hemoglobin undergoes denaturation in the presence of salicylate. So when salicylate is removed, hemoglobin is renatured. Immunoglobulin chains are dissociated when treated with urea. So when this urea is removed by dialysis, the subunits are reassociated and biological activity of immunoglobin is regained. 